August 19th, 2008. From Atlanta, hi, I'm Brad Fallon with more Web 2.0 news you can use. First up, sometimes it seems like SEO tools are a dime a dozen these days, and it's hard to know which ones are worthwhile until you've tried them all. Traffic Travis is one of the better tools we've seen. It features everything from a keyword finder to a page analyzer, and it has an easy to use interface. And unlike a lot of SEO software that's of this caliber, Traffic Travis is free. Next, tag clouds are great for a lot of reasons, and there's a lot of ways you can use them. Wordle is a free online tool that lets you create a tag cloud or word cloud out of any text you throw at it. The cloud then displays all the words from the text based on how frequently that word appears, just like the tag cloud in the right-hand column at freelinereport.com. Plus, you can easily display the words in different fonts and formats. Elsewhere, Stompernet faculty member David Bullock is always thinking about sophisticated ways you can get more out of your ongoing keyword research. In A New Definition for Keywords, he suggests that you should be looking at the conversations of search phrases rather than just current search volume. According to Dave, a conversation is the history that a keyword has with a particular subject. For more on this intriguing idea, as well as a link to his companion piece, Keyword Conversations for Fun and Profit, follow the link at FreelineReport.com. While solid keyword research is an important part of any good web marketing campaign, Archaeologist is a new web application that lets you analyze and study keywords and phrases found in Dig. Each keyword is presented in a convenient timeline layout, allowing you to track its popularity over time. For more tools such as Archaeologist, feel free to visit FreelineReport.com. And finally, it seems like there are five or six more Web 2.0 companies, tools, and websites launching every single day. To give you a visualization of the scope of social media proliferation, SimpleSpark created a video that flashes all the Web 2.0 company logos they could find into one short video. And that would be 5,000. They go fast, but it's pretty cool if you have 333 seconds to kill. Until next time, I'm Brad Fallon. Thanks for watching, and tune in tomorrow for all the Web 2.0 news you can use in 2.0 minutes. For Web 2.0 news you can use in 2.0 minutes, visit FreelineReport.com.